My name is Michelle Cuyava. I'm originally from Anaheim, California, and um, the reason why I came into Dr. Korsky's office is because I had this abnormal looking kind of mole on my face. I wasn't too sure what it was, and um, it continued to grow and it kind of concerned me, so I came into her office. Michelle came into my office and we noticed that she had a spot on her face that did not look normal. So the first step is to take a biopsy. So Michelle came in and we took a little biopsy. We sent it off to a dermatopathologist who read the slides and told us that Michelle did in fact have a little skin cancer. So once Michelle was diagnosed with a skin cancer, we went over the various options to treat the skin cancer. Now Michelle is really young and we wanted to do the most uh, definitive treatment for her skin cancer and to do the least amount of tissue damage. So we chose Mohs, which is a step-by-step -step process. What we do is we take a piece of tissue and then we look at it under the microscope. And if the tissue is clear, then we stop. And sometimes it involves taking many levels. And in this situation, it did involve a rather deep, we call it a defect, when there is you know, a loss of tissue. The cancer was actually really, really close to my eye. It was probably about the size of a pea. And um, Dr. Sikorsky, she extracted it out. And by the time she was done taking out all the cancer cells, it was like the size of a quarter. So it was, it was a pretty large piece of skin that was taken out. So then our next thing, once we have the defect, is to close it in the most um, cosmetically elegant way that, that goes with the natural contours of the face try to hide it in natural skin tension lines, and to do things that if later we need to do to kind of make it look better, we can laser it and, and use uh, silicone gels and silicone sheeting to help the, um, the healing. So, you know, here at Natural Image, we try to take into consideration the whole process, how to make every process um, as painless as possible and to have the outcome be as good as possible. From then until now, um, it's been about almost four years, so March it'll be four years, and just the whole um, healing process has been great from even the beginning of taking, out, taking the stitches out. You could barely even see the scar, even back then when they took out the stitches. It was barely noticeable at all. I'm extremely happy with it, with the Mo surgery.